On behalf of expertvillage.com, I'm Eric Williams. I'm here to tell you about the tuba. Okay, so we played the, the low B flat, which was our fundamental tone of the tuba. Uh, and it was an open note, meaning no vowels were being depressed. We have um, various other open tones that can be made on the tuba. And sometimes people are bewildered by that. They figure, well, these valves are what make all the different notes. How can you play different pitches without moving any valves? Well, let me try to demonstrate. It kind of evolves from where you're buzzing your lips. If you're buzzing your lips very low and relaxed and kind of slow, is going to give you a low tone. But then if you go with a tighter buzz, it may give you higher pitches, and you can keep going higher than that even. Go. And even though none of that may seem very glamorous, it does create different notes on the tuba. Let me try to demonstrate that. Here's the low one again. Now, without moving any valves or any fingers, I'm going to try different notes. So I already got three. How many more can I get? Let's try another one. different tones produced simply by changing your lip buzzing. Let me try a few more here. Wow. Now tubas aren't usually meant to go that high. <laughs> That's why it's so tough to make those notes work right. If you stay down in the low ones, you'll probably be better off. Try this one again. That's my favorite. 